Hello everybody, welcome to the Impressive Channel. Earlier this year, I did do a video on Kelly Rowland's girl group called June's Diary, and I talked about their journey and what happened to them. They were put together on BET's docuseries called Chase and Destiny, and they were supposed to take off from there. However, there were a lot of industry politics that held them back. And I did go into detail about it in this video. So if you get a chance, I would highly suggest that you watch it so you could see what really happened with the group June's Diary. Now, I do wanna talk about one of the singers who almost became a part of June's Diary, and her name is Maya Dyson. Maya always loved music, and she had dreams of becoming a singer and a songwriter. When she heard that Kelly Rowland from Destiny's Child was holding auditions for her new girl group, Maya jumped at the opportunity to audition. She used this opportunity to honor her late aunt, who was her main inspiration for singing. There's so much about this crazy game they call love that I'm trying to understand. So could you be my best friend before Maya's voice really impressed Kelly Rowland and her music director, Frank Gatson. Both Kelly and Frank were working together to find some of the best contenders for their group, and Maya was one of them. Maya is a Nubian goddess. She's so beautiful. Where are you from? I'm from Woodbridge, Virginia, but currently I live in Boston. Oh, wow, Berkeley College School of Music. Yeah. During the time Maya auditioned, she was a sophomore at the prestigious music school called Berklee College of Music. Maya actually admitted to dropping out of school just to audition for the group, and it was a huge sacrifice for her, but this was her dream and her passion, and she saw this as an opportunity to help her break out as an artist. Maya's amazing vocal ability helped her go far in the competition. Even the renowned vocal coach named Stevie Mackey chose Maya as his pick to be in the group. Maya, I would love to see her in a group. If but I saw a group I mean, with that, her that, face that, in that it and her voice, yes. and she can go down low and she I see, sits I see. down. And here she was wonderful. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Her and Ashley's voices are, are both sit down really right. well, I understand. Like fine but wines. I like both of them. Fine wines. Fine wines. Maya made it to the final round of the auditions, but unfortunately she was cut. After getting eliminated, Maya did resume her schooling at Berklee College of Music. And while she was in school, she got an opportunity to sing background for the Grammy Award winning artist Solange Knowles on Saturday Night Live. Also in 2017, she released her first EP called Elevation, and she got an opportunity to have her own showcase at the Essence Festival, which is really a big deal. Maya also continued to do vocal showcases at Berkeley. It's universal, so rip your city so, so, so. graduated from Berklee College of Music, she got another chance to sing with another Grammy Award winning artist named India Ari. Maya actually toured with India this year on her Worthy Tour. This is Maya Dyson.
The song you just heard is India Ari's song called Follow the Sun, and it's so beautiful. And Maya sang so amazing when she did her solo. Maya is still currently singing, and she did release an EP called Elevation, and she has her whole EP on her website. If you get a chance, please listen to it and support it, and also visit her social media pages so you can get the latest updates on Maya's music. I want to give a special thanks to Maya for sending me her story, and I can't wait to see all the big things that she has in store in the future. Anyway, tell me what you all think about this video down below. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video if you care. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!